me today out on a bike. If you're new here, this is all about my journey on the Cambridge 1 to 1 plan. And this is me getting some exercise. So follow for more, hit the subscribe button and the like button. And I'll check in with you all in a moment. But for now, I'm out on the road. <laughs> So, sorry about the quality, but you're in the action, it's live. Oh, right, the one handed. So, we're out in Lincolnshire on my bike for the first time in God knows how long, and I thought I'd bring you my journey week 25, I think it is. I thought I'd bring it to you on the road next time. Be mine. And there you go guys, that was the uh, extent of the filming I did whilst I was on my bike ride. Because one, it was freezing cold, well it wasn't freezing cold, but it was cold. And trying to hold a GoPro out in front of you whilst riding a bike is an art form in itself. I'm going to have to practice. But yeah, that's all the filming I did guys on my little bike ride. I was going to stop somewhere and talk to the camera and do it, but I couldn't find anywhere to stop. And when you did stop, it was just uncomfortable really, so I just kept going kept moving because it is a little bit chilly so yeah that was my bike ride and now into what I lost and this week's chat cheers well hi guys and welcome back to week 24 of my weight loss journey and if you're new here please consider subscribing and when you do subscribe just write that you've subscribed in the comments and I'll talk to you below let's get the conversations going so if you're new here this is all about my weight loss journey on the Cambridge one-to-one -one diet, which is going great. I've lost up to now nearly six stone, and later in the video, I'll tell you what I've lost this week. So, how's it gone this week? Well, one of the positives is, it sounds a little thing, but I've booked my holidays through work, which made me feel a bit like we're gonna move forward. Who knows? I don't know, but it did make me feel so. Booked a week at Easter, uh, and I think a couple of weeks in the summer. So. Worst case scenario, I'll be camping in the back garden with the kids. <sighs> come on Boris, don't let us down tomorrow night. Anyway, so it's Sunday, I've just come back from a bike ride. It was just to try and get out and do a bit of exercise, because one thing I'm doing is sticking to the diet, we're doing really well, a little bit of nibbling in the evening, which I've got my eye on. I've spoke to a um, consultant about it, and you know his advice was just try and drink loads of water to get through it. It's one of them things with these kind of diets, if you allow yourself to nibble, it just manifests into more and more. So, got to understand, like I said, I've been like this probably three weeks now, it's ever since I've come back after Christmas and got back into it. But, I'm keeping trying. In all the drama that's happened, apart from the Christmas week, if you remember where I did put £10 on but then lost it all back, I am still losing. So, I've got to be positive, think positive thoughts about that. So, no one said it was easy, and I don't find it easy just like you guys don't. So, comment below, tell me how you're feeling, tell me how you're doing, because together we can help each other. And I've reached out to a few people, and I'm having conversations with them. And you can see the people, like I said last week, who are really inspiring me and really pushing forward, and others who kind of lost the way a little bit, and you can, you can sense that through the social media. But like I say, I always want to be positive on this channel and a sense of moving forward. Yes, it's difficult, but I don't come on here to just whinge about how crap I'm doing. So yes, it's difficult, but I do feel we keep having these restarts and we move forward. So planning holidays, like I was saying, that just gives me a little bit of a mini goal to get to. And when we get to that holiday, we can move around a bit, we can get some clothes that fit. Just all them little things, little green shoots as I've been calling them, what we get into. So when we are actually out of this pandemic, lockdown, all the rest of it, we will actually feel better. We can actually go out, we can walk, we want to, we can do activities, go to theme parks, go on rides. Think of all these positive things that being a really big lad, I've missed out on. So they're the things that I'm concentrating on. Um, 
like I've said, I went out on a bike ride today because I'm looking at my steps and you're lucky if I'm doing a thousand a day because I'm getting up, working at home, working all day, come down in the evening, it's dark, it's wet, it's cold. Who wants to go out and go for a walk then? Some do, but I don't. I'm mentally worn out and I just sit around and slop, which is not good. You need some activity. So this weekend, it's Sunday, it's taken me all weekend from Friday to here to actually go out and do a bike ride. I've just got back. I've done some footage on my um, GoPro. I haven't even uploaded it yet. If it's any good, I'll slot some of it in here. But, and I'll put the map up, up here where you can see, you know, it's not far I've gone. It's just a little loop I've done and a bit around the village. But, wow, you know, I've actually got a sweat up more than about half an hour, you know, and it was hard for me to do, I'm not gonna lie, but I did it. And that's a small, massive step for me, to be perfectly honest with you. So I'm proud of myself for doing that. I've had two products so far. Like I say, I've literally come straight in, picked the camera up to record it, because I need to edit it. Get some water down me, plan the week ahead. Stay on, stay on plan. Try not to nibble in the evenings, and let's have a better weight loss. So my weight loss for this week, I always nearly forget to tell you, I lost a pound. I lost a pound. So, it's in my own fault really. I had a sugar and lemon pancake on um, Shrove Tuesday. I'm not gonna beat myself up. I had it, I've done it. That's where I'm at. But overall, I've still lost. Now, that's good if I wanna maintain and that's sort of where I wanna be. But I'm still, like I say, I've told you my weight. I was 28 stone 11. I'm now 23 stone on the dot. So yes, it's a massive achievement and it's brilliant and I'm really appreciative to myself that I've done that. Um, I suppose I'm halfway. I've still got a long way to go though. Um, and I think that's what's affecting me because a lot of people, to lose six stone, wow, that's life changing in itself, isn't it? People who are up there and come down to normal weights, whatever that is, you know, they're achieving it and they're there. I've put a lot of effort into this since last August and I'm still only halfway there. I say only still, but I'm halfway there. So that is a positive to take from this. I understand that, but it's still hard. So I've got to crack on and still keep, I need to, you know, I need to be moving, for me, three, four, five pounds. I know you can't do it every week, I completely understand it, but you get what I mean. A pound a week, a pound and a half a week, do you know what I mean? That's gonna be, it's not even half in a month. So. I'm just conscious of that, so hence why I need to get a bit of a sweat up and get some exercise. So a pound this week, week 24. Going forward into this week, what's gonna get me? I'm going into the office a little bit, so that'll move me a little bit. And um, what else? Uh, oh, I've got my COVID jab. I've been called for my COVID jab on tomorrow night, which I've got to go do. Um, I'm assuming I've been chosen that because of my BMI, and that must be it, because I was that big, because We've got nothing else medically wrong. I've got you know, nothing. I don't take tablets, no blood pressure, everything's good. So it must be that. So let's go get that done. So that's it for this week, folks. I hope you've liked this quick update. Shown I've done a bit of exercise. I hope it motivates you. If you're feeling stuck, please, please comment below. Let's get a chat. Find me on Instagram. Let's just keep moving forward. It's really difficult on top of everything else. Weight loss in itself is a nightmare, as we all know. We all set off with great intentions and it gets difficult, nearly swore. It gets really difficult, doesn't it? But we've got this added life that we're all existing in at the moment. But talk to each other. Like I've said, hit me up below in the comments. Subscribe to the channel for more. Hey, and if you've got any ideas, pop them below. You know, I wanna keep this channel moving forward in the, in the future, you know, when I'm approaching goal, I've mentioned it before, when I'm approaching goal, I want to, where's this channel going to go? It's not just going to sit about the Cambridge plan, that's what I'm on at this point, but it'll be about, you know, what I can now achieve moving forward. If you're happy for that, you know, put down what you'd like to see. All the parts of my life, what I do, my family life, like I say, seamless plug, it's not meant to be, but I do have another channel that hasn't done a lot for a while. It's only got a few hundred subscribers. It's called The Boar Family Adventures. I'll put a link below, but they're like days out with the family we've done. We vlog most things. Um, do you want to see that on this channel? Do you want to go over to that channel? Let me know. I've got some ideas left for this channel. 
and moving forward, approaching goal, I know what I want to try. I've got some you know, hobbies and interests I want to try. If you want to see that, let me know. Other than that, guys, thanks again. Keep safe. Keep losing the weight. Keep on that bus. And I will see you next week. Bye for now.